Let's get right to it. You would not believe how many people get these series of questions wrong. These are people who say they know machine learning. I often ask this question to get a general sense of the candidate's understanding of machine learning, and 99% get these series of questions wrong. It's mind-boggling that you'd believe that you understand anything about applied machine learning, and you can't answer these basic questions. Let's go. What is AI? Google defines artificial intelligence as the intelligence exhibited by machines or software. It's also the name of the academic field of study, which studies how to create computers and computer software that are capable of intelligent behavior. When you answer these questions, use known definitions. Use Google's. Don't make shit up. Well, that one was easy enough. Moving on. What is machine learning and where does it live? Machine learning, from Google again, is the functionality that helps software perform a task without explicit programming or rules. That's the first part of the answer and the easy one. Machine learning lives inside of AI. All right, that's pretty easy. So far, so good. Let's dig a little deeper, pun intended. What is deep learning and where does it live? Deep learning is a form of machine learning that's loosely inspired by the structure of the human brain and particularly effective in feature detection. Here's the tricky part. Deep learning is machine learning. Notice the hierarchy. Inside of AI, there's machine learning. And inside of machine learning, there is deep learning. All right, let's make it hard. What's an artificial neural network? A neural network passes data through interconnected layers of nodes, classifying information and characteristics of that layer before passing the results onto other nodes in subsequent layers. Again, that's pretty straightforward. Lastly, let's tackle the question few get correct. What makes a neural network a deep learning model? A neural network is a deep learning model with n number of hidden layers. The n isn't clearly defined here. The key thing to understand here is the number of hidden layers. Now, if you don't know what a hidden layer is, then you won't be able to answer the question. So you're going to need to find out what that is. Now, I understand this hierarchy can be tricky, but why would I hire any machine learning engineer that didn't know the most basic foundational aspects of AI? Psst, I wouldn't. Learn these, learn the hierarchy, and learn them well. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And of course, have a great day. We'll see you soon.